Tommy. Come on. What do you want? Are we gonna go somewhere? <laughs> Good morning, guys, and welcome to today's vlog. I'm so excited to be vlogging again and like have a semi sort of plan for the day so i'm just gonna vlog today and that's gonna be the vlog like i don't care if it's like short or not first off we're going to starbucks because we always do on my days off um and then i'm going to oviedo because my friend is doing like a ride there like a cycle bar ride and i want to go to it it's like free so that's why i'm going <laughs> um basically if you go to different cycle bars typically they're owned by different people so it's like it's not like i can just use ride credits from my current cycle bar franchisee to like another one so that's why i go when it's free because i'm not a member at this one and it's way too far and they don't have like multiple locations for me to go to so piper begged this morning as you can see she was like totally ready to go to starbucks and yeah, so I don't know if she's gonna get a pup cup or not because she didn't yesterday because she hasn't eaten breakfast like both days like today and yesterday So I'm like no, you're not getting one because you need to eat your breakfast before just like a bunch of treats So yeah, no pup cup for you today. She gets to come along the ride It's about 8. I woke up at like 7 30, which isn't bad. I went to bed at midnight So it kind of makes sense but yeah, I'm like, I need to get the coffee early and I'll probably get maybe a cake pop because I want a little something in my stomach before the ride because the ride is like at noon and typically I go, oh my gosh, I just saw roadkill. Typically I go to Cycle Bar like at 9 a.m. Since it was a little bit later when I would typically eat, I won't like have a lot in my stomach. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna get like a cake pop. And then maybe before I leave, like have a little snack, like some celery or like turkey, you know, just so I have something in my stomach. Yeah. Um, and then I think the girls and I are gonna go to lunch after. I think I'm gonna wear my dress, the one that I wore last week, because it was actually really cute and it's like a cute outfit that I could wear out and about as well. So I don't have to like change. I mean, I don't think any of them are gonna change or whatever, so yeah. Before you guys take a picture or video yourself, like do you put your hair over your ears? Cause same, I'm like every time I like press record on this, I'm like, okay, like let's get the hair, the ears covered here. I got the huge, the iced coffee with almond milk, no classic, and then yeah, my little snacks, I have like something in my stomach because your girl cannot wait that long. I mean, I can, but then like also doing physical activity on top of on top of not having anything to eat like for that long is just like, that's a little too much. So anyway, I'm sorry. Piper did not get a pup cup. She's very distraught because she wants a pup cup so bad, but she didn't eat breakfast. So it's like, no, I don't know why. These cake pops just hit. I don't know why they're so good. I love these things. Okay, so I got home and like I did the dishes and just other random things. But I, I made an impulse little purchase on Amazon a couple days ago and it came in. It was like next day delivery, so it was amazing. They're new sunglasses. Okay, don't get me wrong. I really like the ones that I got that were like way overly priced. But they're a little bit too light. Like... The mushroom, I'll show you guys. The mushroom's just a little too light, but like, yes, they help me drive and stuff, but they weren't like dark enough. I don't know, I'll show you guys the lenses. But I saw Aspen, I don't know. Aspen is the one that can influence me to like actually like buy something. Um, I don't know why, maybe it's just cause I followed her for so long and like the weird parasocial relationship. I'm like, yeah, well also too, I just like her style. So I saw her wearing these and these are like $15. I'm like, all right, yeah, I'll get those cause they're not like 200 something dollars. They're only 15. And then I saw this other girl like on Instagram wearing the same glasses. I'll link these down below, but oh my gosh, I think they're so cute. 
They're kind of like this retro vibe. And then the lens is like darker. So they're like almost like a black lens. I don't know. I like kind of like the shape too. But they're like $15 on Amazon. Oh my gosh, how cute are these? And they're like dark. So I don't know. I'm excited about them. And I don't even know like if a real, well, every knockoff, there's like a actual designer. There's an actual designer version probably, but I don't know. I just used Aspen's link to get these and their price point was amazing. So these sunglasses, as you can see, I love the shape, love the design, but you can see the lens color. Like this one is almost like, it's like a black. And this one is more of like a tannish. Um, it's like tan and almost clear. I mean, it does block out the UV, but like it only just tints and probably protects your eyes a little bit from the UV rays or whatever. These are just darker and I like that. That's why I kind of missed my other ones, um, which I could always use them, but I don't know. I just wanted to get these, so yeah, I like them. I took Piper for a little walk. Hopefully she'll eat something. She typically eats after she gets like some exercise. So fingers crossed. But now I'm on my way to the spin class. I had to leave like an hour early cause this place is like 50 minutes away from me. Not excited about it, but it's fine. The ride is free. So it kind of like makes it better. And so far I like these sunglasses. Definitely worth $15, but I feel like the UV protection isn't like, I don't know. I just see like a difference. I don't know if I'm just thinking it too much into it or they're just a little different from my other sunglasses, but I don't know. But I don't hate them. Like I actually like them and they're tinted like perfectly. Like I still don't have to squint or anything. So yeah, so far so good. I absolutely love the shape. It's kind of hard to get used to like the thicker borders, but it's just a little different. But so far, so good. Also too, I wanted to start using my like Louis Vuitton bag again, but honestly, I'm loving this fake Goyard um, because the size is perfect. It's slightly smaller than the Neverfull, so I really like it. And I saw this um, TikTok and this girl was like, I hate this Goyard bag. She got like a real one and she said she hated it because the color like rubbed off on her clothes, like the color of the bag. And then I saw the comments and it was like, my fake one from DH Gate doesn't do that. So I don't know, I think it's super funny. I mean, if I'm in a place now where there is a real Goyard like store, I might get the real one because I'm all about like getting fake stuff and then like trying it out and then getting the real one to see if like I really like it. I absolutely love this bag. I think it'd be kind of cool to have a real one just because I, I, I like it. So I don't know, but I'm not gonna like make a whole trip just to get a bag because I'll just keep using this one for however long. I don't know, I love it. It was $45. I mean, and then these were 12. I mean, at this rate, the products themselves and the quality is still really good, if not better than like the real item. So, I don't know, just Sunday thoughts rattling out of my mouth. We made it to Cycle Bar. You can barely see it, but we made it. <laughs> I had to park all the way over here cause like there was no parking closer, but it's fine. So the ride's over, my friend did so good, and now we're gonna get something to eat. It's like 1.30 and I've only had that like cake pop and stuff. <laughs> All right, they picked a place, so. Whoever gets there first. Anyway, I don't know really where we're going, but I'm riding with Kyra, cause I don't feel like driving, okay, I'm ready. Also too guys, I had to show you, this vlog is finally like good. I don't know, my vlogs have been, I've been in my flop era. Aww. I know, it's so bad. Just like with work and stuff, but I want to show you guys, it's Cosmo and Wanda, our phones. I think it's so cute. Kyra came, say hey girl. Hello. And we're gonna eat at Maple Street. Maple Street Bakery. 
or biscuit. Yeah. No. I think I'm gonna get the kicking chicken strips. Kyra's gonna get that too. And we're gonna get mamosas. Cheers. Get her in. <laughs> Peace on. <laughs> Now for family dinner night, we're at Sicky's Garage. We brought Piper, cause family dinner night. Sherry, say hi to the vlog. Hi vlog. Yeah. Here we are. All right, so we got our food. I got a chicken Caesar salad with fries. Sherry got the wings and the salad over there. And Valerie got a sandwich with her um, onion rings. They love the onion rings here. Piper didn't get anything cause she already ate. Piper! Oh, there she is. <laughs>